Hello, my name's Julian Edgar, and I'm the author of the book Car Electrical and Electronic Systems. What I want to do in today's video is talk about protection diodes. Now, they're particularly important if you're, say, controlling a solenoid or you're even controlling a relay and you're using a programmable ECU, a programmable electronic control unit. So, what is a protection diode? Well, let's have a look here. We've got a coil, that might be a solenoid, that might be a relay coil. It's fed 12 volts and then the ECU grounds the other side, switching it on. Fine, ECU connects to ground, coil is switched on, great. But what happens when it gets switched off? Well, just like an ignition coil in a car, when you switch it off, there's a big spike of voltage that comes out of the coil. That's how the coil generates the spark uh, on, the, on the ignition system. Now, if the coil in your relay or solenoid uh, develops a big voltage spike, that can come through and kill your output transistor in the ECU. So you don't want to do that. Obviously, you want to protect your ECU at all costs. So what do you do? You can add a diode. Now, sometimes called a freewheeling diode, sometimes called a protection diode, but it's really important you get the diode the right way around. Let's have a look. We want to put a diode across the coil. And we want to make it so the diode is orientated like that. That's the same if we draw a diode by putting the band up there. Remember, this line is the same as the band. Now, let's look what happens. ECU grounds can't flow that way because the diodes aim the other way. So I can go through the coil, switch on. When you switch off the ECU, that voltage spike can harmlessly go around that circuit, dissipating itself. That's why it's called a freewheeling diode, because it freewheels. The current freewheels around the circuit. So this is a protection diode. It's been mounted across the coil. If you are using an output on your ECU that is not protected by a diode internally, and you are driving something that's got a coil, like a solenoid, like even a relay, always protect it with a freewheeling diode. Mount it like that. Now, what if you had it the wrong way around? Well, if you had it the wrong way around, you'd have a short circuit. And when the ECU uh, grounded, you'd have direct voltage from the battery flowing through it. And that would not be good. So always ensure you actually have your diode the right way around if you're adding one as a protection diode in a circuit. The book's called Car Electrical and Electronic Systems. I cover the use of freewheeling diodes, protection diodes in the book, and I recommend the book to you. Thank you.